Hi guys, welcome back to Junri's Vlog Reaction. For this video reaction, let's go to Russia once again. Pasiba to our Russian friends and this the title of this video that we need to do some reaction for today is Russia tips and tricks and travel in the Moscow using metro at Russia. This was hosted by Tim Kirby and then he will be like showing with us the tips and tricks of traveling to Moscow using the metro station. And this is our he said this is our new series of Russia tips and tricks and travel to continue to unravel all the country's mysteries for the interested foreigners so to those people like me also who want to visit uh to russia and then using the metro station and this is the video that you want to know and uh to listen and to watch so that you have a guide also and this is so important when you when you want to travel to every part of the world especially in russia in moscow this is just how uh how you can like make your uh, travel so fast and easy and you can like save also in terms of like uh in terms of your time and your money and your efforts get to it guys i hope you enjoyed watching with this one and if you're new to my channel just click on the subscribe button click on the notification bell so that you'll be updated on our future uploads and if you have some comment suggestion related to this video guys or any russian video that you can suggest drop it on the comment section i'd love to read and respond to you all and make your video requests and credit to the owner also with the video to Russia beyond I'll put in the description box below so that you can connect also with the owner of the video so let's get to it enjoy guys and I hope you can get something about this video also later on I would love to hear from you at the comment section enjoy wow. Thank you so much for this I'm so have like the interest to watch through this one. Hi there and welcome to Russia. Tips, tricks and travel. I am a radio talk show host, political analyst Tim and Kirby. celebrity immigrant Tim Kirby. And today we're continuing our series about transportation in Russia or should I say wow. transportation in Moscow. Because today whether you call it the tube or underground or subway, we're going into the Moscow metro. Let's go. Oh my god, see the structure of this. First things first, in order to use the Moscow metro and well, in fact any Moscow public transportation, we need a Troika card or I should say Troika, but I can't roll my R's. All right. Oh, nice. our turn. So, здравствуйте. Дайте, пожалуйста, карточку тройка и наложите на нее 100 рублей. And so the future is here, guys. We don't have to use cash. If you don't want to, you can, can use, use card. any sort of credit cards, including, I think, Samsung Pay wow. and Apple Pay, too. Yep. It's cool. The future really is here. You see, the thing is, when you get your card, you have to tell them how much money you want to leave on the card. The card itself costs about a buck. Oh. Oh, That's thank nice you. and cool. That's Very how, but anyways, like, convenient. Now we've got our card. We've got a couple rides on it. Let's go explore Moscow. So, now that we've got our card, everything is really easy. All you have to do is press your card against this here yellow circle. Wow. On this screen, it'll show you how much money you have left on the card for a brief moment. This light turns green and the gates open. Just this is unbelievable. Like this. Wow. Mm. That's nice. And we're in. Let's go. So right now it's the middle of the day. It's pretty calm on the escalators, as you can see, not that many people. But what happens during rush hour when it's totally packed and totally crowded? Well, there's a rule. Stand to the right, pass to the left. Same as in Japan. Because you don't want to get hit. Sometimes people fly down the left-hand side. Yeah, I think everybody in the world, you should do that one. According to some people, the escalators in Moscow are like so super fast or something. I don't even notice, but maybe I've just lived here a long time. But be careful at the end of the escalator ride. Take That's your time. Cool. Think about where you're going to step. According to my mother, these are the fastest escalators on the planet. Bravo. Wow. So here we are in the metro. It is loud. It is beautiful. It is the top notch Soviet architecture that I love. But the question is, where oh are we going? God. How do we get there? Well, you know, in each car of the train, there are a couple posters it's printed huge. out. But posters, that's the 20th century. We have in our hand the 21st century, the Moscow Metro app, which 
If you click on it, you get a nice map of the metro, and this will allow you to be able to search where you're going, how to get wow. there efficiently. It'll even tell you in so English you and other lost. languages about the history of different subway stations, which is oh, cool. fantastic. It's free to download. Go get it. And so, yeah, it's really fantastic and very accessible. The metro that for the handicapped, the elderly, women with children, and pregnant women. So if you're sitting down and a pregnant woman's in front of you, guess what? You're being a clown, and that's against the rules. Oh. And guess what? Sometimes people take photos of people who do that and post them on the internet. I'm not saying it happened to me. I'm not saying. I'm just saying. You know. <laughs> it's very like funny and so you know interesting to listen. Smell the roses, like you know, you should take time to enjoy life. Well, guess what? I don't see any roses anywhere, but what I do see Ooh. is awesome architecture. Look at how cool this station is. It's like a gothic futuristic cathedral. And that, my friends, is awesome. It's really magnificent. So nice. So very organized and clean. Uh, those wonderful metro voices. Sometimes they're women, sometimes they're men. And believe me, that's not because of diversity. It's to help you tell where you're going. Even if you're a bit of hard hearing of hearing and you don't really speak Russian, you should know one thing. Ah, that's nice. The male voices mean you're either going downtown or you're going clockwise on the ring line. If it's a female okay. voice, that means you're going back, back home, home, away from downtown, or you're going counterclockwise. See, there's a system to it. So, it's all that's the difference. Logical. And sure helps if you don't even speak Russian. Right. Wow, see the structures of the building. So here we are at our final destination, so my favorite metro station, Metro Komsomolskaya. No station embodies Soviet power, military and political better than the station. So cool, love the mosaics, love the gold. But anyways, it's not the only reason we're here to admire it, but in our last video about the Elektrichka, guess what? We filmed that 50 meters up there, because right above this station is three different train stations that you'll probably use if you come and visit Moscow. But tomorrow, I've got to go to work. Oh my gosh, I've got to go to work. And then I got to put money on my Troika card. But the question is, how can we do that? Well, let's do that together, and then we'll say goodbye. Nice. So how does one put money on their card? Well, you can do it the traditional way, go over to one of those cashiers and give them money. Or you can use this terminal up, red metal box machine. Yeah. thing over here. So. Here we go. So first, click the EN button at the top to switch to English. English, okay. Here we go. Recharge card Troika. Not the best English, but it makes sense. So here we go. <laughs> Please wait. And now we insert our card right there. Sometimes wow. it's a little tricky to get it in there. You need the right feeling for it. But anyways. Okay, so I have 39 rubles on my card. That's a little over one ride. Not good. Let's you have uh, to top just up top up enough. your e-wallet. Okay, let's top it up. You have some options. You can pay with a credit card. You can put bills in here. But I'm just going to throw in some old coins of mine. See? Putting coins in. Yes. So interesting. All right. And says so now we click top up your balance. All right. Come on. Yeah. Top yourself off there. So anyways, there you go. We put a little bit more money on our card. And I got rid of some much unneeded change. Fantastic. So. That's all, the Moscow Metro and your Troika card. Believe me, gotta get one of these babies. Wow, bravo. But anyways, uh, like, share, favorite, and ask me questions because this series of videos, Russia Tips, Tricks and Travel, it's all helpful. about answering your questions. So leave some questions in the comments yeah. below. Until next time. Wow, Team Kirby, your sats like very energetic and I love the way how you like travel with us and see the tips and how, it, this is just a short video, but it really helps especially to those people who want to travel to Russia in Moscow especially and using the metro and this is just amazing watching and seeing those like the art and then the architecture was so fabulous and so amazing and so wonderful also seeing with this one and then see the underground or see the like the metro station itself it's so huge and it's not so crowded might be in a busy days oh my god it's so amazing even like even it's busy it's still like spacious because it's so huge and then the architecture itself you know that this span and i saw the train also i think that's uh, they're using the bullet train and it's so fantastic and amazing it's really interesting because the way how the host also team Kirby was introducing with this one is so like lively and you really love to travel to 
Asha and use the med. Thank you so much guys. I hope you get something from it. If you want to see the full video, it's on the description box below. And if you like this video guys, same as I did, just give a massive thumbs up. Like and just subscribe also with my channel. This is Junis Blaga that react saying stay humble, stay positive guys. Pasiba to Russian friend. Bye bye guys.